Find all angles in the domain where theta is between 0 degrees and 360 degrees that satisfy the given equation. Write the general solution. In part a, self-secant theta equals negative 2 non-graphically using a calculator in degree mode. It would be difficult to solve this in a calculator using secant theta. The calculator doesn't even have a secant theta button. Rewrite this as cos theta equals negative 1 over 2. Isolate theta by taking the inverse cosine of both sides. The result is 120 degrees. Cos theta is negative in quadrants 2 and 3. By symmetry, we have a second angle at 240 degrees. The solution over the domain where theta is between 0 degrees and 360 degrees is 120 degrees and 240 degrees. The general solution is 120 degrees plus n times 360 degrees where n belongs to the set of integers and theta equals 240 degrees plus n times 360 degrees where n belongs to the set of integers. In part b, self cosecant theta equals 2 root 3 over 3 non graphically using a calculator in degree mode. We write this as sine theta equals 3 over 2 root 3. Take the inverse sine of both sides. The result is 60 degrees. Sine theta is positive in quadrants 1 and 2. By symmetry, we have a second angle at 120 degrees. The solution over the domain where theta is between 0 degrees and 360 degrees is 60 degrees and 120 degrees. The general solution is 60 degrees plus n times 360 degrees, where n belongs to the set of integers, and theta equals 120 degrees plus n times 360 degrees, where n belongs to the set of integers. In part c, solve cotan theta equals root 3 over 3 non-graphically using a calculator in degree mode. We write this as tan theta equals 3 over root 3. Isolate theta by taking the inverse tan of each side. The result is 60 degrees. Tan theta is positive in quadrants 1 and 3. By symmetry, we have a second angle at 240 degrees. Draw 240 degrees. The solution over the domain where theta is between 0 degrees and 360 degrees is 60 degrees and 240 degrees. The general solution is 60 degrees plus n times 180 degrees, where n belongs to the set of integers.